Hello and welcome to day five Hello. of rehearsals. Hi Gav! Oh, sorry, that was Gav from ESC Tips. Um, I'm just um, going to go to the arena now. Um, and quickly before... I don't want to show Finland on the screen. We're just on our way to the arena now. Oh God. Yeah, I told you these steps are quite hard work. Okay. So, um... We're allowed in the arena now to watch rehearsals, so I'm with a couple of guys from the island team to, to go and see what a, how it looks. This is my first time going down this corridor, so I have no idea how long it's going to take to get there, and I'm already out of breath. Hey! Ah, uh, we're finally in. Oh god. That took nearly the whole song to get here. Bloody hell. Oh, it looks very nice with the lighting here. See, there's Finland on the stage right there. Oh, can't get the um, graphics are not up, so I can't get the full effect of just how impressive the stage is yet. In fact, I can barely see the screens yet because they're not switched on. <sighs> so, <sighs> looks very nice so far. There's the green room over there. <laughs> Hello and welcome to day five is it of my rehearsal coverage. Excuse my shoulder but um, this screen is on and I'm not l letting you see that otherwise the EBU will get let have me in very big trouble. Um, but um, yeah just finished a very long day of rehearsals. We had all of semi-final one do the second set of rehearsals and we also had first rehearsals from France and Spain. Um, I don't need to go over the first semi in much detail just need to see if there was any huge improvements and stuff like that. Um, yeah, everyone improved in various degrees. The biggest improvement for me was Malta. They got rid of the stupid motion tracking projection thingy and just went for a simple walk around in a nice glittery dress kind of thing which looks a lot better I mean it's not uh, um, don't get me wrong I'm not saying like oh my god it's so amazing now I mean it looks pretty good but it's just it, it you know it, call it the benefit of love and expectations it just feels so much better knowing that compared to the car crash we had on the Tuesday um, also Iceland um, changed some of the graphics and it's looking I, I, like I said it's looking kick-ass there so just like I said um, uh, San Marino ditched the super dark um, graphics and went for gold like I wanted I mean it's I mean it's still hopeless but at least it looks better now with a gold disco ball backdrop um, who anyone anything else I don't oh Moldova are testing out singing the second verse in French Nicholas if you want it if you're watching I want very interested to know what you think of Lydia's French accent because I know you rip me so hard every time I try to speak French and um, 
yeah, we'll see if uh, they do stick with that French verse in the end. Um, uh, nothing else of note, really. Yeah, it's just, um, yeah, it, yeah, it feels like people stepped up their game pretty much, so that's it for semi-final one, the second rehearsals. Oh, and I couldn't get an interview with Yuri in the end because he's sick with a cold and went straight to the hotel. Bless him. Uh, get well soon, Yuri, before uh, Monday when you have to do your jury rehearsal. Drink lots of, lots of water and take lots and lots of meds. Bless you. Um... And um, we, yeah, so we had France and Spain do the first rehearsals. France is 2011 all over again. Is not going to win despite being massively hyped. I mean, don't get me wrong. It they haven't ma they haven't screwed up the staging, but it's just bland looking and it's too static for my liking. Yeah. Sorry, France fans. Look, like Le France fans, not the Swedish guy fans. <laughs> I know everyone gets confused when whenever we talk about uh, the automatic qualifiers. Like, are you talking about Sweden or France? Uh, it's quite funny, and I have been caught in that trap and getting confused over what people who are people talking about anyway. But and also Spain, they're doing. A bit of a pratfall, you know. In the official video, they have that so like um, <laughs> moment of tension where they trip up and they're like, oh, no, the dance kind of thing. They do that on stage as well. It was okay, nothing mind blowing, but whatever. Um, so um, yeah, I didn't. I know I promised you guys that I was going to give you short clips of, um, of the rehearsals, but seriously, that track from here to the reader took a good five minutes, and I was there was no chance in a fiery hell that I was going to do that the whole day because otherwise I would have just passed out and collapsed by lunchtime. So I'm sorry, in the, the, loads of websites have got rehearsal clips online, it is fine, it's fine, it's not like you're missing anything by me not having rehearsal clips in my own video, um, so you can see for yourselves on there. Um, so yeah, that's just about it for today, I'm going to leave shortly to go to Nordic night, very exciting, and um, so yeah. Tomorrow we get the rest of the automatic qualifiers, so that's Germany, Italy and the UK. Oh, I'm joining that one. <laughs> Rehearsing tomorrow morning and then second rehearsals the semi-final two. Ah, oh, I get to see my Latvian sweetheart again. And I've been, I said I've been penciled in for tomorrow to get an interview. Hopefully the head at press hasn't forgotten, otherwise I'll be having stern words. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not that nasty. I'm too nice and polite to have a go at delegations like that. <laughs> so I'll report on um, how ed how various people tomorrow have improved. Um, um, so yeah, that's just about it for today. Uh, I don't know it sounds kind of boring because there's not much new that I'm talking about today, but oh well, uh, I hope that you enjoyed this video anyway. So um, that's it for today. So until then, kisses. Bye.